Good morning. Today's day 85 and I officially decided to take an alternate around the snowy section that I kept going back and forth on whether or not I should do. I kept hearing reports of like, oh, it's not so bad. It's sketchy, but it's not so bad. Um, but then I heard reports of people that said it was really bad and exhausting and um, just the, the way they talked about it. I don't think they talked me out of it more than helped me realize what I really want to do and don't want to do. And what I want to do is hike Not Snowy Trail because that's, that's my choice. I don't like trudging through the snow and getting into sketchy situations. So I'm currently walking on the Great Shasta Rail Trail. So here's a map of the rail trail here. And here's the PCT here. So I got off the trail and I walked to connect them between these two. And now I'm walking along the rail trail instead of this whole snowy PCT section. And then Thomas is gonna pick me up at the end of the rail trail and drive me down and then I'm gonna walk down to reconnect with the trail. I'm bummed because I have to let go of the connecting my steps because he's gonna drive me to that connection point. I could walk it, I think it's like 10 more miles, but I don't want to. And I think it's really important for me to let go of that expectation in favor of doing what I want to do and <laughs> not having to do everything so rigidly according to my goals and expectations when really my goal is to just connect with myself, live in joy, and uh, release things that aren't serving me anymore. And all of those goals to level up as Dory um, don't involve needing to connect my steps. And that's okay. So I'm gonna let it go. <laughs> Found all the old railroad ties. <laughs> that's a hard sentence to say. So the rail trail was novel for maybe the first hour or two, but now I'm just so bored. <laughs> uh, unlike a regular hiking trail, it's just so straight and wide and flat. It's not bringing me a lot of brain stimulation. So I decided to choose Joy put in my headphones and rock out to my uh, empowerment dance playlist and it's made this hike quite pleasant. I know I'm doing it to distract myself but that's okay. I'm choosing it consciously. I will say one advantage of this trail that I've yet to see a single person on is that I can sing along to my songs as loud as I want and I know nobody's gonna sneak up on me because I can see for a mile in either direction. So, four non-blondes, what's up on repeat? <laughs> this is a cool little swampy area back here. I see these footsteps over here. I think they're like weird fake Sasquatch footsteps. And then I turn around the other way and realize they're actually bear tracks. Bear track. 
So front foot, back foot. I'm pretty sure I just saw a bear walking on the road in front of me. But it was like far enough away where I was like, what's that weird blondish brownish walking bush? Hmm. I was whooping. Woo! Woo! So it knows I'm here. <laughs> Unless it was my imagination. Okay, I definitely hear something tromping in the woods ahead of me. Woo! 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 If you're not familiar with bears, Making noise just tends to make black bears go away. I'd stop to listen again, but I don't want to stop right next to it. <laughs> Do you hear it? Coming through! I think I finally passed it. Here I go, I'm leaving. Well, that was interesting. Hiked 19 miles today. I'm um, getting back on the PCT tomorrow. Just brushing my teeth, wrapping up the day. Um, finished packing for tomorrow and sorting out all the rest of my stuff. And winding down camp and going to bed.